Hello, uh, tacticians and strategists, fleet commanders and Viper pilots, welcome back to Battlestar Galactica Deadlock and playing hardball and our struggle, the continued struggle against the Cylons. Cylon Onslaught. So here we have our mission against the Cylon Warband. Raphael got orders to destroy them all. Uh, let's go right in. Let's go right in and see what we have to do here. So, well, the last battles, despite being kind of messy, uh, went well, all in all, everything considered, I would say. Um, yeah, and here we are. So, let us use our guys. No, let's try something. That's actually that's our newest, the Kensit. Kensit. Yeah, why not make a quad burger, right? Quad sandwich, so like this. And well, actually, I think we can just stay back here with these guys. Go there like so. Or maybe like so. And you guys go here. There, there are actually that's oh that's eight ships again. Okay, so that should uh, that looks like a bigger thing, so let's rather be careful. Especially as this is a special mission. Yeah, so actually we we can be careful. Oh and here you guys are not really aligned. Like so. Yeah, that's good enough. The sun over there is a little bit uh, blinding. Fleet group is jumping in three, two, one. Wham, wham. Precise jumping, just as we love it. Dratus Thanks, contacts. Helena. Marks a confirmed hostile. Thank you. Okay, good. There we go. Euribia. Identification, please. Well, I guess like with eight ships, it could be everything. And yeah, well, it can be everything. So On it, Commander. Fly in like so, while the others keep a healthy distance. Maybe even start flying in a little bit. You guys, you actually turn around like so. Understood. Launching Launch alert vipers. Squadrons. Very good. And then let's see what we've got. They're actually flying here in this direction. But then, oh yeah, well, they, they made a turn. Ah! Revenant in the front. Okay, well, let's rather not get into their shooting range. So maybe, maybe we are actually, let's fly like so. And then while we fly here, we might identify someone else. All Vipers rally point the Euribia. And well, I would I would argue let's have it at the Revenant then. All missiles away. And yeah, you guys actually fly lower. On it, Commander. Ladies and gentlemen, there we go. You guys shoot your missiles at them as well. But I think, yeah, we are rather keeping our distance here. Ending the turn. IFF confirms unit is hostile. 
Okay, another tail in there. <laughs> That's good, lots of missiles coming in. And then you guys, yeah, you actually like for the moment you boost away. Which is actually not so ideal, but we do have plenty of targets and these guys... Oh, well, or actually... Let us remain defensive. We're just flying like so, and that way we should draw the all the raiders here very nicely and also away from their shots. Oh, we do have four raider squadrons. Well, but we do have we do have actually a good number of vipers. So, and I'm tempted to stay. Yes, commander. Over here. So the radar is actually flying into our turret fire, but uh, yeah, I think we should rather be careful. So let's go here like so. You guys fly there. And then I guess it will be fine. Oh, and by the way, you guys should also shoot your missiles. There you go. And then you can also shoot with your F turrets at those radars, ending the turn. Ah, oh, yeah. We have identified a nemesis, these guys. That is a nemesis over there. And now, actually, you guys. Or rather, you take out Squadron those raiders. Squadron target is confirmed. You guys stay vigilant. Defend the Eurybia against the missiles, please. All missiles for the Revenant. And you guys are actually flying higher. On it, Commander. So we definitely shoot this guy on the top. And that's actually pretty good right now because I think like they seem to dive. Could be that we get lucky and everything shoots them on the uh, on the top. That would be actually pretty nice. Although they have of course 60 on the top and only 45 on the on the sides, but I guess it's fine. So oh yeah, and they are shooting at the Bypass. Good. Let's fly erratic a little bit. So let's have a look at the Dreadus. Any nasty surprises yet? Because we need to expect everything. But everything seems to be fine, okay. So we can just draw them out a little bit. So ending the turn. Fighter right squadron there. is taking fire. Shooting at our vipers. Good. We neutralized their missiles. Very good. Oh, there is a second revenant. Oh yeah, th that's very nice. Shot everything on the top. Very good. Guys. Understood. Right there now. Oh, the Vipers. Well. Oh, actually, the Vipers. Go for these guys. And you guys go for them. Yes, sir. And you shoot them as well. Yeah. Yeah, you can stay defensive, that's fine. Adamants just need one more turn to prepare the missiles. Make sure we can continue on this height level. You can actually on it, commander. fly higher. So we definitely get this one from the top. And after that, we I think uh, 
that those were actually pretty good shots well maybe we get even lucky and uh, these missiles will destroy the first revenant already and then we can actually start shooting at the uh, the nemesis over there up there that tries to sneak up on us okay so we do have a nasty dogfight over here though but we outnumbered them yeah but Squadron's they are really oh dark. Yeah, they were really uh, focusing on one squadron, one poor squadron. Very sad. Okay, but we get the upper hand. We're winning the upper hand. I think they are just maneuvering nicely, so actually we will hit them in the left. Missiles were too slow. It's kind of a pity. But I think we will Onic, need Commander. to shoot the nemesis first and then we neutralize any problems with missiles as well. You guys, shoot it as well. One full salvo, please. Coming right up. Okay, and then here. Actually, I had hoped that we could fly a little bit slower and then they would come into the detection range. So let's actually, let's fly like so. Let's maneuver around. We're not under threat yet. And that way we can also stay closer to, to the Vipers uh, and maybe someone can actually react. So I need the turn. Yeah, lots of crossfire. Yep. They are getting it into the side. I don't know, but actually, IFF oh, that looks good. Looks good. Hostile. Oh no, now they are getting it uh, with the right side. Okay. Hmm. Lots of missiles coming in for the Nemesis, though. So the Vipers made it actually. So there, there is one more Talon. So you guys are actually attacking this Understood. one here. you guys fly around like so and you can also shoot your missiles at this guy that should make this revenant think right like how to maneuver if the missiles are coming from different directions okay then the ranger okay good all right so otherwise everything is fine. We are flying rather predictable though. Yes, sir. And uh, let's change that a bit. Just in case. Because we don't really know what kind of ships these are. I mean, if they had missiles, they would probably have shot them already. IFF confirms see. unit is hostile. Aha. Revenant in the back. Well, that is actually kind of an interesting fleet loadout. Oh yeah, nice. We, we hit him in the side and the back, I guess. Okay, good. And you guys get out of there now. Yes, Commander. And if you can, you can actually shoot with your F-turrets. And you guys, you just work on the Revenant now. Or the other guys. You, for example. On it, Commander. Shoot at this revenant. You guys shoot at that revenant as well. And you guys are not finished yet with reloading, right? No, you're not. Okay, so there we go. They lost their whole squadron of vipers. Very, very, very sad. 
Uh, and by the way, so the Andermans, they can actually go on the attack. Although I think no, it's, uh, it doesn't matter. So let's uh, let's boost like so. And now let's watch what our missiles are doing to their nemesis. And I'm a bit confused why the nemesis is actually not. Yeah, that's good. Yeah, very good. Why they didn't shoot any more missiles? Very nice double kill. Very nice indeed there. You guys fly high, and actually you can boost around now and away. And the Vipers are in a pretty good position now. All other ships. Just keep on flying. And then we'll see. So, but that went, that went well. And you return. So, Vipers, how are you guys doing? Yeah, that's good. Very nice. Concentrated fire. Oh, that is beautiful. That looks very, very good. Yes, excellent. Very nice. We are, we are like nicely lined up here. Excellent. That went really quick and smooth. Very nice. Very nice indeed. And now these guys are being hit as well. That is beautiful. You guys shoot at this Revenant, which is also like the most dangerous thing for our uh, ships. Yes, Commander. Flying there, you guys. Yeah, actually, you could start boosting. Just to impress them with our grand speed. And then let's have all missiles flying the Revenant's way. You guys actually go a bit higher so that we make sure that the missiles come from top. Very nice. Nice explosion back here. There we go. And let's end the turn. That looks good. We are really chewing through their armor here. Ah, but they are... Yeah, but that's good. It's good. It's good. It looks good. But we are not exploring them right now. Okay. But that's good. They are nicely aligned here. Very nice. So it was actually, I think it was a good thing to split them up a bit. You guys shoot them as well. And for that, you go a bit higher as well. And you others, the others, here are they? They just uh, keep firing until this thing explodes. We are just not taking any chances. You guys go higher again. Understood. You just stay there. Alright. Ending the turn. That looks good. Back there. Nice. So it's coming in. Very good. All off from the top. Very nice. Very nice indeed. Vipers. Have the first victim. Under the talons. You guys continue shooting at the Revenant and I think actually like with this salvo the Revenant should be done. Yeah, otherwise guys just fly ahead. Let's enjoy the show over here. Ending the turn. Good, another fire there. Here you guys are shooting. Very nice indeed. Yeah, it's fine. So like here. This one looks very badly now. And the turn. There we go. Very nice in the distance over there, the Revenant. Gets a lot of missiles now. Okay, they try to uh, present the left side. 
Oh yeah, and we actually made it. Now you guys go for that Talon. Oh, did, did that work? So there. Manticore, just one more turn. You guys. Yeah, let's shoot another salvo and then I think we are we are done with the revenant. Which means that you guys shoot your missiles at that Talon. And you as well. And now it's the thing, the bookmakers. Take bets. Who kills it first? The missiles or our vipers, right? But their their flying is actually pretty good here, I think. So they will not explode now, I'm rather sure. Oh no, actually. All oh one missile actually took away five structure. So they are fighting desperately here. Oh what's happening? Oh, 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 a traffic accident is about to happen. Let's not let... let's not... Uh, let that happen. There you go, and then you guys... Shoot them. Oh, the Vipers. Continue their good work. Very nice. Very nice, wow. Uh, that is a lot of firepower concentrated there on a very small space of Talon rear. Oh yeah, well, I think the Vipers will win the bet. And here we go. And I think we can just... No one is uh, flying into anything right now, it's fine. We can just enjoy it. The missile is crashing into this one, exploding it, great. Coming here. Oh, but the missiles are actually hitting it. Okay, nice. All contacts I down. Mission. Thanks, complete. Helena. I think uh, the Vipers got the kill. Very well done, Raphael. Looks like the next promotion. Let's have it, a review. I like the sandwich. I really like it, and also like how they maneuver now. Very nice maneuvering there on part of our frigates. Speaks for the discipline of our space sailors, right? And on their professionalism. Uh, speaks for their professionalism. But I have to say, like when the Cylons shoot their missiles, at least the Nemesis, I think that's one of the coolest sounds of the whole Battlestar Galactica universe. Because there's something threatening about it and at the same time also non-human kind of. And this one here, it sounds very much like normal missiles, I think. But when the silence do it... Uh, so speaking of role-playing, I think the devs uh, made some really cool choices here, uh, or not even the de uh, the devs, but uh, uh, the sound the sound designers created ba the new Battlestar Galactica, because the sound is of course from the series. There, you are going to blow up very soon now. There are lots of missiles there, and oh, we didn't get to see the explosion eh? because this one is even more spectacular. There you go. They shoot through that revenant very, very quickly. I was actually a bit surprised. But I think they, they could really uh, concentrate their fire very, very nicely there. Actually, given the number of ships, I think this fight was actually rather quick. Because usually we have some more problems. But, uh, well, we do have lots and lots of uh, Vipers around, of course. And our other uh, fleets were actually not, not that strong. We 
But I think in the star system we are doing pretty good now. We have pretty good fleets and our commanders are really experienced. Can coordinate lots of ships, that's just great. Yep, this one is already burning in multiple locations. There you go. Nice perspective with the Viper there. Yeah, that blow. Oh, that looked like a cascading explosion in there. Very nice. More missiles coming in, and yes, that ended them also. Yeah, very nice. So, very good. Very good indeed. And the Astana got the second veteran status. That's nice. That is very nice. Their elite. Yeah, so for some reason, I'm not sure. So it must be the commander's ability, but uh, they also only had five. Um, like for their stands, but we have seen up to eight. Okay, I have to check that one. Or maybe someone can help uh, and explain that. Uh, but I guess it's uh, it's part of the commander's ability. Like the strength. Yeah, yeah, I think that it's the CIC strength, I guess. Okay then, so this is where we can end this episode. Thanks for watching. I hope you liked it. That was a pretty cool battle. Um, very clean, although we lost one Viper squadron. But I think it was nice to confuse them a little bit so that we were basically in two directions. On the other hand... Uh, I think, yeah, it was mostly because uh, the enemy was flying so low, so we could uh, shoot the missiles all, mostly at least, all in uh, one location, the top of the ships. And that sped up the whole thing, right? So, again, thanks for watching. If you have any comments you wish to share, please do so in the comment section. And you are very welcome to click the like button and subscribe to the channel if you haven't done so yet, so you never ever miss an episode again. See so you next time. Bye-bye.